Well, good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday, 444. Let's take a look at the tropics. We got Tropical Wave Invest 94. This is one that we have been tracking for a while. Doesn't have a lot of steam yet, but it's holding together and it is expected to continue its trek out west, very likely making its way into the Gulf of Mexico by this weekend. We also have Invest 95. This is a tropical system that's strengthening pretty quickly. This one came off the coast of Africa a couple days ago, so it's still way out in the ocean. So it's got a lot of warm water to track should it hold together and I think it will. This one, by the way, also has a pretty good chance of maybe heading out toward the Gulf as well. This is a good 10 days away, but something that we'll continue to follow and keep you updated. In the meantime, look at this. We got some rainfall after yesterday's high of 99 degrees at GSP. We are going to be cooler today. It's still going to be hot, but look at these clouds that alone is going to keep us a bit cooler. And then some of this rainfall dropping down from the mountains moving in across parts of the upstate. Not everybody gets wet, but hey, we'll take it as we go into 8 o'clock, 9, 10 o'clock. We'll see some of those isolated showers and then again later this afternoon, maybe a few downpours or thunderstorms. This unsettled weather pattern, well, that will continue tomorrow. We'll see a few spotty showers as well. Again, not everybody's going to see rain, but look at that. More and more of us will. It's going to be exciting around here. Everybody that gets a shower or two or three. I'll be excited myself as we take a look at Saturday afternoon and evening. A few more of those. Here comes Sunday. Guess what? We've got another cool front that's going to come through late Sunday into Monday. That will be our best chance potentially of seeing some more widespread rain where if you missed out on a spotty shower between today and then you've got a pretty good chance that one or two may come your way. So great news there. And of course, that's going to keep our temperatures a bit lower. So not going back into the upper 90s anytime soon. That alone is pretty good news. The farther into next week we go, the better chances we could see a little bit more rain. Hey, highs night of about 90 degrees. That's pretty close to the seasonal average. I'll take it low 90s for the better part of the next several days. In fact, wouldn't be surprised if we don't pop up in the upper 80s a day or two. That would be pretty nice too. If you're looking for the 80s, head to the mountains. It's going to be much nicer with a little bit more chance for rain each day.